holiday horror. Kids were crying on the airport. Southwest Airlines continues its surge of flight cancellations. And our flight got delayed and delayed and delayed. And Kelly Maine is from Mount Air, but flew southwest out of Kansas City to Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Cancellations forced him to book an Allegiant flight back to Des Moines, but his journey isn't over. Now we just have to rent a car and drive to Kansas City to get our vehicle that's at the Kansas City airport. Despite that runaround, they'll get home before they could on a Southwest flight as the airline is telling customers rebookings cannot occur until December 31st. This is an extremely horrible experience. After a memorable family cruise in Miami, Mike Patel and seven other family members flying Southwest were stranded. So he booked an Allegiant flight just to get to Des Moines before driving home to Omaha. Four days we were stuck. We had to book this Allegiant flight for $3,000. Then yesterday, hotel night by our own food. It cost me 10, by car renting, Uber, it's almost $10,000. Lisa Del Signor was supposed to fly from Omaha back to Albany, New York. Their cancellation has forced them to hit the road on four wheels with a rental for a 16 hour journey but may have good news waiting. The Southwest agent told me this morning when I talked to her after being on hold for four hours and at four in the morning that um, we should keep our receipts that, and then submit a claim through Southwest. And she said from gas to food, lodging, and your rental car. And she said, you know, the plan is to reimburse people. For the few passengers that have been able to reach their final destination and maybe even flying Southwest, they may breathe a deep sigh of relief but the matters only seem to get worse if they're renting a vehicle. The problems are wreaking havoc on rental car carriers like Hertz. We are completely out. It's, it's been crazy um, with all the flight cancellations. Um, we've been, you know, swimming up creek without a paddle. Just like the piles of luggage in front of the Southwest counter, frustration is piling up with customers saying little has been done by the airline carrier to help ease their stress. I never recommend somebody for Southwest as well. They were not helpful at all. Southwest has alerted customers flying through January 2nd that they can rebook identical flights within 30 days of their travel date free of charge.